did people just come up to you while you were away telling you how much they miss Bran? We had a bit of that. We had. A, I look totally different now, though, from when we last saw Bran. So not much of that, actually. But uh, I certainly miss Bran in season five. Yeah. How did you keep in touch with everybody while you were away for a season? I kind of didn't. I was kind of away from it all. It felt really weird. It was like not seeing my family for a year. You had one of the most badass moments in the trailer. I think a lot of people gasped when they saw it. Tell yeah, us, tell us I gasped too. What did you think when you saw it? I was like, what? Watching it, you can imagine filming it. It was like, <gasps> How much of his sort of seeing eye stuff are we going to see this season? Is that a lot of his journey? That, I think that is... That's because that's what has been kind of hinted at the past seasons, and that's what Brand's been building up to. That's been his destiny the whole way through the, the entire series. So this season, we get to see Bran kind of explore it and sort of begin to master it and, and learn to use it in, in a way that for the audience will be really cool to see, but for Westeros, could be pretty crucial. I remember talking to you in season four, and you said you'd love to see Bran become a bad guy. Yeah. Still hoping for that? <laughs> I don't know actually, I think I might have changed my mind. Having seen a lot of the stuff that Bran has to learn this season, I'm starting to think actually we want him on the good guys team.